It's going to be a tight schedule for the University of Michigan men's basketball team. Their plane slid off the runway yesterday, and now they have to fly to Washington, D.C. this morning before their game this afternoon. Yeah, 7 Action News reporter Shelly Childers is at the airport. Shelly, when is the team expected to take off? Well, Malcolm Anu, if all goes well this morning, we are expecting the team to take off around 730 this morning. They're taking a private charter jet from Detroit Metro Airport to D.C. They're expected to land there at 845 this morning. Then they're driving straight to their noon game against Illinois. So like you said, a very tight schedule for them this morning. The team was trying to take off yesterday during those high winds and their chartered plane got caught in wind during an aborted takeoff at Willow Run Airport. Then they skidded through a fence across an access road and finally stopped on an embankment. That plane was damaged and everyone on board had to use emergency eg exits to get off the plane. Seven Action News was there and we spoke with coach John Beeline about the experience. It puts so much in perspective right now um, that uh, everybody's safe and everybody's, uh, you know, we have a few uh, people banged up a little bit, a few cuts, a few bruises. Uh, but other than that, uh, everybody's healthy and, and it could have been much worse. The coach said it right there. It could have been much worse. We know that there were more than 100 people on board and that they did suffer a few cuts and bruises, like he said, but no one else was seriously injured. The FAA and NTSB will both be investigating this crash. Malcolm Anu.